Hello everyone, Troy again here from BBR Worms and Greens. So now I'm going to continue my uh, kind of uh, finalizing the experiment of, um, <clears throat> excuse me, of basically uh, showing you the 0, 10% and the 20% uh, castings mix and their root structures. So uh, just for a quick recap, I do it in each video, or at least I, I should have. Uh, this one here just had um, uh, miracle Grow premium indoor potting soil uh, with, with no, um, you know, with no castings. This had 10% by volume of castings and this had 20%. So we already went over the overall look and how kind of sad and nutrient de deficiency these guys are. Uh, now it's basically just going through in, in these next couple of videos to the root structure. So, um, the... Uh, what is it there? The um, cilantros. I did them yesterday, and uh, I'm going to do them a little bit smarter, a little bit, a little bit better of a way. I'm going to basically just show you the root structure of all three, assuming they stay together, uh, before I pull them apart. Uh, it's just a, a better, better way to do it. And the other way too is there's only, I should say, the other difference too is that there's only two plants in each of here, so they're all identical. They all have two, only two. Um, and the only difference is the uh, volume of worm castings. And uh, they were not given any nutrients, uh, which is why they look so sad. Um, and they all had somewhat the same uh, light source. And I want to keep these. I want to throw a whole pile of nutrients in there and stuff like that, so I'm really trying to uh, maintain these nicely. So, um, I don't have three hands, so I can't hold them up uh, kind of all at the same time. But uh, let's start first with the zero and the uh, ten percent. So so ten percent is on my right, and zero is on my left. I'm kind of just moving them around. I know you need like let's say a hundred sources before uh, you really figure out whether these are. You know, basically, basically a law of large numbers, right? You want a lot of numbers before you figure out whether something is actually truly a thing. Uh, you know, that being said, and it seems like I, if anything, I overwatered these, and I, I didn't really mean to. I don't know if I overwatered them or not, but uh, I thought they needed water, and I'm very happy I didn't give them any more water. Um, but I, what I can tell you is that I think the one on the right definitely has more more root structure. So this is probably the, yeah, probably the, the, the most for this side. And this is probably the most for this side. So um, I, just, I just feel like this one is going to knock it out of the park. Let's compare the 0 to the 20 and see. So like you can see... You know, there's just there's just far more, uh, you know, far 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 more roots, um, you know, consistently. So there's a lot of roots on on at least two of the sides. So yeah, so let's say on this lighter side here, there's not as many roots, but then on this lighter side here, there's also not as many roots as well. Um, but the roots that are showing are, as far as I can tell, significantly bigger and a lot more abundant. So again, this is, you know, you're, you're talking this, you're talking awkward angle. Sorry, everyone. So I believe, uh, anyways, that the root structure over here is uh, significantly more advanced. Um, let's see, I'm trying to check one more thing here too. No, they'll have a, I mean, this one does feel a little drier, but not by any massive amount, but there's definitely less moisture in here, which also makes sense because um, worm castings uh, have more water holding potential. So you're, you're definitely gonna always get more moisture held into something that has worm casting than not. Um, it's only like about maybe 10%, uh, more 10, 15% more, it really depends on, on how many worm castings and what your worm castings are made out of. So it's not like it's a massive thing it's not like you're putting in um you know like vermiculite or something like that but it's 
it's something, right? When there's a lot of droughts these days, it's something. So anyways, that uh, this ends this video. And I'm going to clean this up, repot them, and um, give them some nutrients later. And then uh, be done with it. All right. Thank you very much. Have a great day. And like and subscribe, please.